Well, hello folks, welcome to a very dark MTA Daisy mod. So I've always wondered, well, and I've not wondered because I've seen it, uh, I wanted to uh, record a nighttime episode because you don't really, I don't really record it at night because, uh, oh, you can see for yourself it's rather dark at night in this game so this it uh, you're seeing exactly what i'm seeing i cannot see a thing so it's 10 times harder now i think it goes even darker than this but i think it's a setting i've got hold on so it should be it's a night time mode i think that's real time See, there's usually a setting that might be on or not, I don't know. That see, round about this time, round about 10 o'clock, it gets really dark. And obviously you can still see the sky's bright, bright. So I don't know if it's any mode, I don't know. Because you can still see that the night time, it's the road and that, it's still quite dark looking, but the sky's still quite light. And... As time goes on, it gets darker, and by two o'clock in the morning, uh, you lit you literally cannot see a thing. Right now, I can't, I can barely see. So just imagine this like a few hours from now, when it's really dark. So as I said, don't know. Oh, let me check. Have I just turned that on? I think I have. Yeah, I have right. Okay. Um, hold on. Let me just move my steering wheel. It's only MTA. There's this. Well, it's, uh, San Andreas, I should say. It does it with. But for some reason, if it, my steering wheels are plugged in, um, the camera goes all weird. I'll just unplug that. That will stop it doing it. I think I've just activated it. Once you activate the wheel, <laughs> if I unplug it, that will stop it moving. Right, so let me see. Ah, uh, let's see. Edible night time, that one. So it's actually on, right? So. Against all odds. Does that mean I've survived a day or what? How do you check your achievements? I know you can, maybe, maybe it's in the journal. That's that. Uh, it's not just a dream. No, it still says it's only day one, so. Unless it's. Uh, still alive for more than five hours. Alright, that's what it is. So maybe it's similar to, I was going to say similar, maybe, uh, hold on, there's, cancel that, Mark, so it still says day zero, right, um, hold on, let me just, Close this for a sec. Um, I know it's a bit cheap, but uh, I'm gonna need to keep having to reset my health. Um, because the food just drains so quick. I'm gonna see if I can change the settings to reduce the food and that. I can see frames are fine. So I don't know. 
Oh, the compass then. Hmm. Anything else? Oh, so you can press one or five. It will bring that up. There's probably all different functions I don't know about this game yet. Or the mod, I should say. So that's. Alright, oh, it's what we are facing. Because if I face that way. Yeah. Okay, so I'll put that away. Shame the lights on the top don't work. And I don't think this will do anything. So I don't think this works anymore. Um, so I'm trying to remember what's what. I think that's that way. I think that's the height. Anything? No. Up a bit more? No. I'm gonna check something. Um, obviously I'll despawn it if it doesn't work, but let's see. If I can get them to work on this car. No. I decided an end it doesn't work anymore, that's annoying. Hmm. Unless I'm not doing it right. You can see it's quite laggy when I'm not in a, I'm in a car that's not supposed to be there. Let's just delete that. And uh, quickly. Uh, four. Take that off. Right. I'm not even finding it a lot today, I'm just driving about. What we probably should do though, do I have any on me? Uh, yes we do. Okay, 
some fuel so we don't run it. And we've got a couple of tanks, a uh, tank canisters as well. So we've got a full tank. That'll do. That'll probably do this episode. God, I cannot see a thing. I did them, but I think they were crashing the server. Hold on, I'll check. Okay, there we go. Did I not? They're not a map, are they? I'm pretty sure they're a resource. Interesting. Definitely I did there, man. No well. Did I add that one in there? Yeah. Okay. Um refresh. Oh See if it updates them. Maybe I should have turned the engine off first. Is that it? No, I guess I didn't add them. Alright. See, my food's just going down right away. It should not be lasting 20 minutes. Even that with 10. That's ridiculous. So I'm going to need to have a look at the settings. I thought well, I'm doing this, I uh, turn the engine off. But I don't think it would be in here. I think it's in the actual config file. See this this is just all stats, so Definitely not in there, so um, I'll do that next time because I need to, as I say, I need to add those resources in. So while I'm doing that, I'll change the food, the hunger, because it's just going way too quick. So I'm barely lasting like 10 minutes before I need to keep eating. I really don't know.
Du, du. I wonder if I can change this guy gradient. I remember I used to do that all the time. And it was fun. Guy gradient. Um I used to do that all the time, and I was like, Welcome to hell! <laughs> and I would make it up your raid. I just let me just do that. Because I think, I can't remember what mission it is in single player, but the sky gradient actually changes. Um, God, you'll need to look through GTA missions or something. But there's definitely one that changes the gradient and makes it appear different. It's funny. What we could do, hold on. Rather than having it all red. We can have red and blue. Like so. So it makes it sort of purplish. But I think that's hurting my head. So basically how you reset it is you basically go Clear all that out, and you yeah, type in reset sky gradient zero, and it basically sets it back to normal. That's the not blocked off. Because hmm. I, I remember, I think of it. Uh, no, I don't even get that map loaded in. Cause I had a map called City Fix Up, and it basically fixes that. It puts a big wall up against it so you can't fall through, and also adds a few train tracks. Uh, crossings where they should be, uh, traffic lights in some places which aren't there. I don't know why my maps aren't showing up. Oh, maybe if I refresh it again, maybe. I definitely put them in. I don't know where they are. Oh well. You 
you can't really search things at night because <laughs> you can't see them. But you can if you want, but good luck. It's just, the server is 24-7 so it's always on as you can see on the description below but it runs on no time from the UK just so you're made aware so if you're coming in from America um, afternoon's your best time because that's when it's still light if you're in Australia you're screwed you need to come on about eight, 9 o'clock at night or something also speaking of that uh, people were leaving comments in one of my videos saying that it it was taking too long to download, that's because it's 250 megabytes. It should be a decent download speed depending on your own inter -connection, internet connection. And it might hang on the downloads but it will download eventually so give it time, that's all I will say, it does work. So just wait, it shouldn't have any problems. And I'll even show you. Okay, so turn the engine off. I always, if you're leaving the server, don't spawn in a vehicle. So sit outside it, otherwise you'll probably bug it or something. Right, so disconnect. I'll show you how to go on, basically. Once it disconnects, so I'll take a drink of water while we're waiting. Taking a little bit of a load. Alright, so browser. This one here. Default one's just my test one, so just ignore that. As it is the IP up the top, so you can't exactly miss it, plus it's in the server as well. Double click, it should join. So here's the bit, as I say, it takes a while because it is loading stuff, it will load. And there we go, so, if you're just joining the server, click on register, put in your, your username and your password, click register, and then, click on your login, Put in your name and your password and then click login or just click on it apparently. No. You will log in. That's why I say don't spawn. Uh, make sure you're not in a vehicle when you disconnect otherwise... Because uh, oh, whenever I've done it, it will either look bug or you spawn inside the vehicle and then the vehicle will end up flipping upside down and then you're without a vehicle. So that's why 
if you do leave, make sure you don't, you're not in a vehicle at the time. But anyway, that will probably be it for today. I'm gonna, well, I'm not gonna head back to my base because I don't want to see, well, you just probably know where it is by now, if you know. <laughs> it's pretty obvious where it is at the moment because where, where I'm always starting and finishing the recording. If you don't already know that by now. But anyway, thank you all very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed tonight's nighttime version of NTA Daisy. It will return again during the day in the next episode because I'm going to do it in a couple of days' time. And I've got some time for it. So until then, goodbye for now.